that's what's cool about being here because when you're just here for a while and you're smoking a lot you have these kind of visions enlightened you know like you, you see the world differently that's what I love about this place hun and as I was out on the set yesterday remember I told you I was doing that movie thing I was making the streets dirty it reminded me of when I shot the doper's guide here remember when I was here for those 10 days and with Lee Dove and Man, it was such a great experience, and, and that was the beginning of, of, of my, my uh, engagement, you know, with this beautiful city, the woman, Amsterdam, like that thing I read to you a couple of days ago. But the other thing that's been happening is, is, is this, this feeling about freedom. You know, I've been reading about America and all the stuff that's been going down there, you know, and, and, and a lot of it doesn't make me very happy, you know, and it made me realize that the freedom that they have here, that the people in Amsterdam, the people in Holland, this is what our forefathers had in mind for us to have over there. I mean, here we come to this beautiful place. You know, Columbus finds it. There's always Native Americans here. They're smoking cannabis and hemp. They, like, began at the harvesting. Corn happens, right? And we just come in and, like, knock everything down, build fucking highways and say, no more pot, drink. What happened, you know? And, and because of the alcohol, all the Native Americans, right, they have that gene that causes them to become alcoholic and they suffer over it. If we just left it alone and let them smoke the cannabis and just cook corn, we'd all be doing fine. And basically that's what happened here in Amsterdam, and I'm realizing that. Look at this. Look at all the candy I can eat. If I ate this much candy back home, I'd be sick. But here, you could smoke, you could eat candy. I went to Fibo today. Delicious! Had the chicken. I wanted you to have the chicken here. God, I so wanted to take Ada Fibo. She would just, the little hands opening the little doors, you know, she would have been so happy. And it costs like nothing, a euro a shot. I mean, we take it to, to freaking Disneyland that one time. It was like $2,000. No little doors to open. That silly music. It's a small world after all. Bullshit. This is where freedom is. Right here, honey. And I, I'm going to start doing some writing. All right, I may even start a blog, the Larry J blog, and start to really talk about the stuff that I'm starting to really get in touch with. I'm fired up, man. All right, I love you. Wow, I haven't said that in a while, but I do. Bye, hon.